I apologize for the lack of content for a week, but there are things that I can and cannot control in my life. As I'm starting to get more serious into my life, there are so many videos that I want to make. However, there are also videos that I have either never bothered to upload because I didn't think they're not worthy enough to be uploaded anyway, but man, it's time to upload them anyway, right? But there are also some really old videos, and I mean really old. Now, very few know that I've been on YouTube for years, even before this account. However, because Candy Kill 10 has forced me to lose multiple accounts through the power of false flagging on YouTube, uh, YouTube has sided with the bastard on nearly every case, all because he's a Christian and I'm an atheist. Still, some of my oldest videos can be found if you dig hard enough. However, I feel like it's time that I upload some of my, some of my oldest videos and show them to you. You might consider it a scapegoat for me to fill in the void of my channel, so that way I don't have to make new videos to entertain you guys, but I want people to know the history I went through in order to even get this many subs. Like I stated many times that I could have gotten this many subs years ago if it wasn't for the fact that YouTube, it, false flagging system, is broken and biased towards atheists. And chances are, if YouTube is going to start abusing the flagging system for copyright, sooner or later, people are going to abuse the flagging system the flagging system to get rid of YouTube videos that somehow harasses or to be considered to be spam. When that day comes, I have to be ready. Now, there are future videos that I have planned for everyone outside of just playing old videos. There is still the topic about the whole gender spectrum, and I even made a thumbnail about this. There is, this, this is where I show you on how stupid, uh, people have become to the point where gender can be based on your mental condition. I'm not fucking around. And then there's the fall of Social Justice Warriors part 5 and part 6. This is where I discuss on how Social Justice Warriors handle a rational discussion. There I will show you a collection of clips where Social Justice Warriors attend me's in order to interrupt them and shouting, and putting period blood on their faces. And then the next part will be, wait for it, more Jenny McDermott drama. And the trend of social justice warriors leaving YouTube. And then there's of course the video response that I have to make towards MTV and other YouTubers. Then there is Trailer Terror Episode 3 of Ghostbusters, not to mention the drama that's being spilled up by social justice warriors yet again. And then the next video is about consent, to touch women's private parts along with my submission to the hashtag the F word. And I want to create an outro for my channel with a separate intro for my trailer terror videos. And to tell you the truth, part of me is a bit tired. All I want to do is play some video games because that's the one thing I have barely done in my life ever since the massive increase of popularity. I need to find more and more materials in order to entertain you guys. Which is why there's a small lack of interaction on the internet. And the worst part is, I don't even have a Patreon page. So now you guys know what's going to be ahead. So I can guarantee that there will be many things for you guys to look forward to. I am the Atheist Gamer. Peace the game out.